Thanks for joining us. We are following breaking news right now at the Mall of America. Here's a live look over the scene from our Sky 4 helicopter. We do know the mall is on lockdown this evening after police say a gunman fired shots inside the mall. One shopper told WCCO they heard several loud shots. Let's get right to Adam Duxter, who is outside the mall in Bloomington. Uh, Adam, what can you tell us? Yeah, Frank, just moments ago, Bloomington police confirmed that they're working to lift the lockdown here at the Mall of America nearly 90 minutes after those first reported shots fired around 4.30 this afternoon. And we are outside the north entrance and exit here at the Mall of America, the main entrance. And you can see so many people still waiting. So many of them are telling us they're waiting for loved ones who are still inside the mall on lockdown, waiting to get brought out to safety. And the people we spoke with earlier outside the mall here here say they heard a verbal confrontation followed by multiple shots fired and from there they say it was an it was a matter of getting to safety getting out of the mall as quickly as they can they describe a chaotic scene people running to get to safety while trying to figure out what was going on in the video we're showing you right now shows a little bit about exactly what that scene might have been like inside the mall again we're still working to confirm exactly who was shooting and who they were shooting at but Bloomington police do say it was isolated into one business inside the mall and again just moments ago we spoke to people who say it was a absolutely terrifying moment for them once they heard those shots ring out we were about to go to the Nike store and we saw we just heard a loud commotion and then we just look over and when we look over we just heard pop 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 and we just all everybody started ducking and running. Yeah, we're from Chicago. We're here on vacation, so this was like it's just so sad, you know, that you can't even go anywhere with your family because of fear of what can happen. You know, but then you don't want to lock yourself inside the house and not go anywhere and mingle with people either. So, you know, it's just hard, you know, to just be with your family and have fun and not have to worry about people just shooting. And again, Frank, we're still worried. We're still waiting to hear from Bloomington police right now. We have no word on if there's a suspect in custody or any word about victims. The people we spoke to out here were quick to recall. This is the second time now in just about eight months. There's been a shooting inside the Mall of America. Again, you might remember on New Year's Eve, the shooting that took place then. Bloomington police do say once this lockdown is lifted, the mall will stay closed for the night. So they're asking you if you don't have loved ones inside or if you are not in the mall already, just to stay away from this area for the rest of the evening. Understood. Scary afternoon. Adam, thanks for the live update. Again, we don't know if anyone got hurt in the shooting. Police think that the gunman ran out of the mall and they are currently interviewing witnesses. WCCO's Marielle Mose has been speaking with shoppers who were inside that mall. She joins us right now. So, Elle, what have you learned? Well, Amelia, I've talked with several people who are currently in lockdown waiting for police to okay them to leave. They told me security was swift and orderly when people were trying to get to safe places. And a few moments ago, I spoke with someone who says he witnessed that shooting. Kyle Martin and his sister Becca were inside the Nike store buying sneakers. He showed me the receipt. It was for 415 this afternoon. And right around after he made his purchase, he said two young guys in their 20s were in an argument. His sister was the one who helped him get out of the way before things escalated. I saw a fight between two guys. They were fighting. And I didn't really think anything of it. You know, people get into arguments. And then everyone started running out. Um, and I, she, my sister was yelling at me to run out with her. So I did. I saw the two guys. They were probably like 10 feet away from me. And then I turned to start running. And then maybe like a second after that, I heard three gunshots. So the reason they're driving and they're not in the mall is because Kyle and his sister were able to get out of the mall before it went on lockdown because they witnessed that shooting in real time before police were able to intervene. Plus, the Nike store is relatively close to an exit, so they're able to get to their car right away. And Amelia, we want to emphasize again that the mall is closed for the rest of the evening after lockdown is lifted. That's such a scary situation, Al. All right, thank you. Uh, stay with us on TV and online. We'll, of course, uh, bring you updates on this breaking story happening at the Mall of America as we get them.